it's me still on the bean and welcome back to some more feed the beast revelation yes we are back here on the server and um today we are joined by uh zindian and ozzytron 123 uh oz uh, i see your question uh I'll, I'll answer you later buddy <laughs> I'm so sorry. Uh, but yeah, guys, if you're still enjoying this series, then please do stop on that like button. Also, if you're new to the channel, then why not subscribe for daily videos? Yes, uh, I make videos daily. And um, if you want to come and join this wonderful, beautiful server, then head on over to Patreon. Link is in the description down below. And if you follow all the information there, you will be able to gain access to this server. Right. Uh, ooh, what's happened here? Is, is we not pulling stuff out of here no or what? why are you not importing why are you I, I, I don't want to mess around with this uh, maybe that cable's been disconnected I'm not sure yeah there you go that's because that's been disconnected right yeah never mind we'll, we'll sort that out uh, now um, but yeah uh, right so last episode we were making the industrial foregoing plastics, and uh, I have actually uh, managed to get there. Let me just type in uh, cable. Yeah, there we go. We've got quite a few of these. So let's just grab uh, five of them. Let's go and repair that. And um, we'll go over to the industrial foregoing uh, um, uh, machine that I set up, which was the, uh, the tree rubber bob if you remember and um, right so if I connect that there now with that will that now start pulling those items out I hope it will I, I, I hope it will but I'm, I'm not gonna mess around with it at the moment it's not like I've got the uh, quarry running but here we go this is the machine we set up last episode now uh, this thing is is doing well uh luckily it's still got uh, wood to burn uh, this guy not doing so great really not doing so great he has run out of uh charcoal and he ran out of diamonds so let's uh let's grab a stack of you and, and get this thing working so that it can actually uh, uh start producing for me i'm not happy with this tree farm it needs to go it really does uh it's, as lovely as it is it causes a lot of lag and it's just not helping me out it's not feeding these guys as much as i need it to and i need it to feed a lot so I'm going to get rid of it, um, and we're going to go for the industrial foregoing uh, planter and harvester setup. Uh, now this guy does make uh, this tiny dry rubber quite quickly, and uh, we have plenty of fluid in here. I mean, I just came in here and this was full, uh, so I don't actually need to make any. But let's head on over to the uh, the ME crafting terminal. Yeah, they're gone now. Uh, the ME crafting terminal, because um, like I say, I've already cooked up the rubber. Um, which means we can actually start making a start in this mod and uh, getting the things that I need. So it is the planter and harvester, I think it is called. Uh, so if we type in up here um, uh, at industrial, industrial, uh, that'll do. And we are looking for, do 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 do, no, not mob du duplicator, but we will be eventually. Uh, so it's a plant sower. Plant sower and no 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 plant gatherer so we are going to need this guy uh which means we are going to need to do, 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 do this 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 there we go done uh let's make two of those because we're probably going to need two um and then uh we're going to need some gold gears as well so let's make like six of those because why not and uh let's see Nope, we don't have it all. Uh, plant camera. Uh, let's make this then. There we go. The machine frame. We're going to need another machine frame done. And then we're going to need uh, one and two of you. And we're going to need one of those. There we go. Done. And then plant camera, please. Oh, man. I made two axes. Why would you do this to me? Um, let's have a look. Uh, why? Why, 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 why? Axe. There we go. Why, why do they not? Why do they not come into the system? There we go. Plant gatherer done. Uh, so we now need to put in at industrial. At industrial. There we go. That'll do. And then we need the sower, which is the one with the little things on top. That guy there. Uh, do we have everything? Right. We've got the pistonian. Uh, can we make this? 
Yes, done. Uh, can we make a piston? Yes, done. Uh, can we make uh, an iron gear? Because I think that was what I was after. And I think that is it. Um, why? Why? I just, uh, is, it, is it another iron gear? Done. Yeah, there we go. Done. Right, so just these two things are fantastic. But if we type in upgrade, like so... There is a certain upgrade you can put in here. It's called the range upgrade. Now, uh, last time I did it was... Uh, um, it was uh, Diable 20. Uh, but I do want to find it. Right, uh, speed, energy, and then there's a range. But the range doesn't appear to be here. Um, what happens to the range upgrade then? Let me type in uh, range in here. Let's see. Let's see. Uh, R A N G E. Range upgrade. I'm sure there was a range. There, there. I know there was a range upgrade. No. Huh. Uh, was it this? Uh, no. No. Hmm. I I know it. I'm up. Greed. No, let's type in Tesla. Te Tesla. Te uh, at. Tes. Is it te Hez? Tesla. Uh, base add-on. Machine case. Speed. Speed. Huh. I could have swore. Unless it's been removed. Oh no, here they are. Range add-on. Energy field add-on? No, I want this guy. I want I want this guy. I want two of those. Uh, so what, what's that going to require? Uh, uh, range uh, add. Yeah, there we go. That's the guy. That's the kitty. I, I knew it was... Uh, an, uh, really? It could be any colour. Just, just show me the white. <sighs> range. Range. I mean, it just... Come on, do you really need to cycle through absolutely every single colour? I just don't really want to press the thing to... Blue, brown, green, red, black, blast. There we go. Thank you. Okay, um, okay, let me, um, oh man, I can't wait to get the, the cobble works set up and going. Do you know what? Let's make one of those right this second. Let's get a cobble works up and running. <sighs> right, cobble works. Um, we'll forget the range add on for a moment. Let's get, let's get the cobble works going. Uh, I can't do that there. I need to do it here. Um, uh, C O B B L, uh, cobble. Cobble works. Is it that guy? Cobblestone generator from nuclear craft. Hmm. Cool. Uh, no, it's not that. It's it's. Man, I'm just having one of those days. It's at industrial. Uh, I am spare uh, fluid craft energy field. With a builder. Hey, I can't wait to use that. Yep. Yeah, yeah. Material stonework factory. Requires pink slime. I don't have pink slime. Can't get that going. Right, guys. I'm going to go and get some sand. <laughs> See you in a minute. Okay. Uh, I have the glass. So let's make two of these guys. <laughs> One and two. Right, done. Uh, the next thing we're going to need is some item duct. Um, I T E M. Uh, we have plenty. Let's grab three stacks of that. And then we're going to want to reinforce servos. And we're going to need a place for these to go. Uh, so let's, let's do the drawers again. Draw. Oh, man. I'm out, out of breath. I just totally ran up my stairs. Uh, so uh, yeah, we're going to need another drawer. So what was this? This was... Is it oak trim? 
I can't remember what I put in it. Was, it was quartz and... Quartz and... Uh, da, 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 da. I'm stuck. I'm stuck. How did how did I make this? What what's this made out of? Um, it was quartz and something dark. Uh, what have we got dark? But basalt. Basalt. Uh, yeah, let's try basalt. I I can't remember now. Um, <laughs> I haven't been on here long enough. We have the quartz there. Whoa! I did not mean to do that. Uh, we have the quartz there. Let's take out the wood. Uh, and try this. Yeah, that looks about right. Right. It's close enough. That'll do. <laughs> I don't care. Um, right, okay. Let's head over to the area that I've got set up. So, I uh, have this little area set up over here. Um, I want it just, like, literally right past my base. Now, what is the range of this thing? So, let's place down the plant gatherer. Because that's going to give me sort of, like, the rough idea now. Um... Let's just say, nope, that's not the middle. So let's place that just there. There we go. That's the middle. And if we show range right now, uh, you can see that that's the range. But if we place this card in here, uh, the range extends massively. Now, I just want to check. Did I get this right? Uh, so we have the range in this direction. Do we have the range in this direction? I feel like we do. <laughs> it's almost as if I knew that was going to be that well I, I kind of overextended it but that will be perfect where it is um, so the next thing to do is we kind of need to work out the center of where this is going to be so we've got uh, I'm assuming starting from here so one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen 14 15 16 17 18 19 20 yeah, we're still going. 20, 21, 22, 23. We're getting close. 23, 24, 25, 26. So it's 25. So half of 25 is... Well, it's it's 13, really, isn't it? Uh, is what we need. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. That's where... Our, uh, our plant sower is going to go. So what we need to do oh, is is count along here. Um, oh, I don't know. I'll just keep going until I think I'm above the dude. That's probably the best bet. That's the easiest way to sort this out. Oh, dude. I think I'm there. That was close. Um, so let's break down to here and uh, let's break into here like so. So we are going to need, we are going to need to add power to this machine. And then we're also going to need to send. So we get, this thing's going to gather and then we're going to need to send all the items down there. So let's make a, a little, little pathway like so. Don't worry, guys. I know what I'm doing. I've done this before, but I did it off camera. I think I did anyway. I'm not sure. Right, let's uh, let's go down here. Uh, let's make our way out here. There we go. Beautiful. Right, so we're going to need to run power over to here. Uh, probably the best way to do it is directly um, underneath here. If I, if I keep going this way, I'm pretty sure I'll pick up... Uh, a power cable. I'm almost certain I will. Um, so yeah, I'll tell you what, look, I'll get all this wired up to save you uh, the trouble of being bored, and um, yeah, I'll come back to you. Okay, so I feel I got it working uh, how it should be. I mean, I'll, I'll quickly just show you how I've um, wired it up. It's simple stuff, guys. It really is. Um, so obviously we've got power going to here. Uh, power is connected to all the way over there, so let's um, let's run down here just so I can sort of give you an idea of uh, how the power's set up. Um, let's just 
crack on to here. Uh, so there we go. So we've got uh, uh, the plant gatherer. That's got power running into the back. And then here uh, we have whitelisted oak saplings. Um, and I want them to go to the furthest first. Those saplings. I didn't set that before. But I've set it now. So this is the furthest place to go. And then in here it's going to send those saplings in. And those saplings are going to get planted by this machine. That's what that does. Uh, so if we run up here and just replace the uh, the soil, and we can actually, uh, I mean, we could, we could fill that in, but I kind of want it to sort of fill up the whole area. I mean, this is a massive area. Uh, so then when this thing picks up stuff uh, and starts harvesting these trees once they start growing, um, it will put stuff in, into its inventory. We'll get sludge, but don't really worry about that. Uh, we can deal with that later. And because it is set to um, extract saplings to the furthest first, um, it's not going to try and send it anywhere else. It should just take it straight from there without being a problem. I mean, I could connect this cable up to here and, and, and that would extract, but I'm just going to put that on there and then I'm going to tell that to, to do nearest first and I want it to take everything. So I'm just leaving that as is. So like I say, once we get a tree growing, this thing will start trying to plant it. And once uh, this thing's actually full, um, I can actually put a piece of dirt over here and just kind of leave it and forget about it. Uh, so I kind of need like the, the, the tree farm to actually start producing for me. Um, so let's just uh, let's run this uh, along here so we can hide all this cable. Um, and then what we'll do is uh, once we start getting some trees, uh, saplings and things like that into here, I can actually uh, uh, lock them off and quantify them as well so that we can, uh, we can find out how much the quantities are. Um, and we should be good to go. So um, yeah, I'll um, uh, I'll leave that to do its thing for the time being. What I uh, would like to do now, uh, just while that's uh, kind of cooking away and uh, uh, planting a load of saplings and stuff, is uh, I would like to allow all this to start going into this system over here. Um, that'll allow these things to start receiving wood, like this guy here. Uh, you should get yours first and fill up. And then these guys will start getting some wood and uh, start being able to fill up. Now I need to somehow connect the wood from there to over here. And the only way I can think of doing it is literally digging a hole straight in the side of this mountain. And, um, and doing it that way. So I think that's what I'm going to do now guys. Is I'm just going to do that, get this set up. Um, and then yeah, yeah, we'll, uh, we'll, we'll come back once it's all ready to go. So give me a few minutes. I'm sorry. And I'll be back shortly. Okie dokie guys, I have the tree farm all set up now. I think uh, I think it's pretty good actually. Um, let's just throw those into there. It's already collected uh, two of those, uh, 21 of those, and none of these as of yet. I'm actually just using these for food. Um, let's, let's put that one in there. There we go, you can have that. Um, so yeah, so what I've done was run that cable. Like I said, it's going all the way over there. And that reminds me, before I do, uh, this just uh, this claim... Uh, all of these and and chunk load all of these. I'll tell you what look we might as well Wow, can I really have 2,000 loaded chunks? Let's do it. Uh, no, I don't I don't want to overload But let's let's just say this is my whole working area. I don't think I'm gonna need much more than that But uh, yeah, this thing is ready to pull wood uh, And send it away. This thing is is cutting down trees as you can see not as laggy as as the other machine definitely not um, and we should see like uh, sludge building up in here where it's actually cutting down trees and then we've got saplings uh, either going into there or they're heading over into here uh, so that is a good sign uh, that we are we are making we are making woods guys we are making woods uh, so all I need to do is, is literally just switch this guy on um, and he should start pulling the the wood out of this draw yet so we've got zero there and they should be making their way ever so slowly ever so slowly uh over to here where they'll start getting burnt provided um it, it doesn't take forever it should i mean it, it shouldn't do but i know it will um but eventually that will make it here and then it'll have a constant stream because the tree farm will be going crazy uh pulling all stuff out and eventually it'll all get backed up and, and be beautiful. It will be beautiful. Um, but uh, that, that is it. I've done the tree farm. I'm happy with the tree farm. Uh, the only uh, exceptions that I need to make to that is to just add a couple of void 
uh, upgrades to it and I think we can do that quickly now uh, if I type in uh, void v o i oh uh, v o i d void upgrade uh, should be doo -doo 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 -doo. not that guy this guy uh, can we make a couple of those one two there we go brilliant just enough for two um, and let's go and place those on those um, the apple and the saplings and then that way um, it doesn't matter how many apples or saplings we get they will all get voided away anyway because let's be honest we don't need that many uh, so you've got a void upgrade after 2048 and I can actually upgrade this to to hold a lot more but I, I don't think it needs it as long as it can pull it out I, I don't really care and this should be yeah yeah like, apple finally we got one um, so yeah there we go that is that done right so the next situation that we need to check on is our, uh, our, our co coven how do we do we got 39 blocks of coal but the issue was our tank filled up which you know you can understand that's gonna happen um, so uh, it is now time to make the blast uh, furnace I think it's called blast uh, furnace now we can't make the reinforced one but can make this one I believe uh, provided we make uh, brick and nether brick her and uh, blaze rods or blaze powder which I think I think is quite doable for us to get those uh, materials now so let's have a look at blaze so we have no blaze rods or blaze powder and the only way we can get it from uh, starlight infusion uh, crusher uh, brimstone and blaze lantern um, if we What's that? Energetic redstone, maybe? I'm not sure. Uh, so I think it, it, it's a quick trip to the nether to go and get as many blaze rods as I can possibly get my hands on. Luckily for me, I do have my, uh, my sword here, uh, which does not have any looting on it. How many modifiers? We've got three modifiers. Let's put some, let's put some looting on there um, so that it will help me get more more stuff and how we did it? <laughs> no armor whatsoever uh, do we have uh, void V uh, yeah there we go void crystals let's clear you guys out and let's do this there we go let's make the chest plate I mean it did kind of last for me uh, last episode or last time we made the uh, the void uh, stuff so we may as well make it again uh, because we've got nothing better um, so let's come out of here and do that, 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 that. That will give me at least some protection uh, against the blazes when we do come ac across them in the nether. And uh, if we just take this guy and, and add like a bit of uh, looting, can we, can we, what's, what's the looting at the moment? Uh, 64 out of 180. So we could add a lot more. Let's, let's see if we can add a lot more. Uh, there's no point no point not trying uh did we did we add lapis to here maybe we did not maybe we did not uh lapis i mean we we have a fair amount of it we may as well add it um yeah we'll add the looting just so literally we can get as many blaze rods as we can um and it'll be kind of cool uh so if i do that that's going to be 192 128 out of 180 i don't want to use up uh, all of my all right so that's 132 and then if I do that that's 176 uh, then if I do that 184 no let's do that 180 there we go cool uh, so let's go and throw that in uh, I'm gonna go to the nether I'm going to grab myself an absolute ton of netherite um, and I'm gonna grab myself an absolute ton of uh, blaze rods so give me a few minutes guys I will be back short. So here we go. I actually uh, I found a blaze spawner. Um, I, I've literally spent quite a while on this already. Uh, these give me magma cream, so not so great. But um, yeah, I'm just gonna sit here and literally, uh, I think, just like farm these guys if I can. There we go. Let me just go around the corner here. Uh, and eat some food so that I can regain my health. It's taken me a lot to get here because I actually had quite a bad nether spawn, to be fair. Um, 
yeah, it, it wasn't good. But yeah, anyway, I'm just gonna sit here. I'm gonna um, I'm gonna farm these guys until I probably get like I don't know, maybe twenty of these, uh, and then I'll pulverize them down when I get home. Yeah, <laughs> I'll see you guys in a second. Okay, so that was a fairly easy trip to the nether, to be honest. It wasn't uh, all that bad. I'm going to put those in there, get those cooking up, and I'll come back for them in a second. Uh, because we need nether brick, from what I remember. I don't know how I'm doing for clay. I'll have to check. Uh, pulverizer, I got 36. I think if I do 18, that should get me enough. Enough? Enough. I think I need 27 again of those. Uh, so, in actual fact, uh, while that's doing that, let's throw you into there. Uh, in actual, uh, let's do that. Let's cook these all up into nether brick. You never know when we, uh, oh no, that can't go in there. We need, you never know when we need that stuff. So, uh, let's have a look and see how we're doing for clay. Uh, can I throw all of that in? Oh, if you do this, you get four blaze rods. <laughs> so that made life even easier. Uh, there we go. So, let's, uh, let's do clay. Play 52 and uh, the blast furnace. Oh. oh man, I never get used to this. Uh, B L A S T uh, blast furnace is uh, so we're gonna need bricks and you get three per recipe. How many bricks do we have? Uh, Why do you do that, man? You, you start to write. And then, oh, uh, okay, all right, I think we're going to have enough. I think we're going to be good here to be able to make the 27, I think it is, we need. Uh, there we go, there's a stack of those. Wow, I didn't think I would get a full stack. Um, so that's going to be plenty as well. Okay, so let's see if we can get this thing uh, cooking up. Uh, brick, blast brick. No, not nether brick, we need blast brick, so... Uh, let's type in blast again. Blast. Uh, and then it's this. And then that. And we're going to need 27. There we go. Done. <laughs> that uh, wasn't as bad as I expected. I expected worse. Oh, and we need our hammer. Uh, there we go. And we need some iron as well. I-R-O-N. Uh, I don't think it cooks up iron blocks, does it? We, uh, we could try, but I don't think it works like that. I'd like it to, because that would be good and awesome. Uh, but I don't think it's going to. So, uh, I was hoping I'd be able to do this. So, let's just uh, head back over there. How's this, how's this farm doing? Oh, yes. Look at that. So that farm is going to work well for me. Um, in terms of power, so I'm quite excited about that. Uh, let's just grab any old block. What we got? What we got? What we got? Uh, a few of those that'll do. Perfect. Um, yeah, uh, what I wanted to do, well, if possible, is to put the uh, blast furnace on top of this. Um, I don't know whether that that would work or not, but I'd like to try. Uh, so let's do one, oh, one, two, three. Um, one, two, three. One, two, three. Like so. I don't like how dark this base is, if I'm honest. Right, can I smack that with a hammer? <laughs> no. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. It, it works, it works. Yeah. Uh, so, if I take the 39 of you out of there, can I put you with you? Yes, we can indeedy. So, that now means that I'm going to be able to make blocks of steel. Uh, 38 at least blocks of steel. So, um, that's going to be great. Thank you, uh, Ozotron. Uh, do appreciate it. Let me just go and check uh, how this is doing. Um, so, we've got 33 in there. So, it is, it is moving along slowly. Um, and it should still be moving along with with this going. Yeah, you can actually see those firing up and then you can see all of these are now starting to produce power. So that that one tree farm down there is actually made this work even better than it did before. And I can actually get rid of this train at some point. Uh, but guys, I'm going to leave it there. If you did enjoy them, please do stomp on that like button for me. 
Also, if you're new to the channel, then why not subscribe for daily videos? Uh, I make videos daily, and uh, I uh, yeah would appreciate you subscribing if you enjoyed. Um, if you want to come and join the server, then just head on over to Patreon. The link is in the description down below. Uh, and if you pledge on there and follow the instructions, you'll be able to... Uh, gain access to this server and the uh, direwolf 21 but thank you so much for watching i've been stop the bean this has been feed the beast revelation and i'll see you in the next episode <laughs> <laughs>